Hi Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. This reading for today, Sagittarius, this is a collective tarot reading session for you, Sagittarius. I hope you're doing well. I hope your finances have been doing good. This reading for today, this is for the Sagittarius sign. Let us see what is coming towards you, Sagittarius. What is the guided message that is meant for you to know and ready for you to know? This is for the Sagittarius sign, please. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you so much for being here. If you would like to further connect with me, Sagittarius, you know what to do. All of the details is down in the description box below. Please don't forget to click the notification bell. And so for today's reading, we will pick up love, career, money, and general situation, okay? If you would like to further connect with me, Sagittarius, I invite you to also follow me. I've got a main channel, and the name of the main channel is Sunshine. I hope you follow me there. Okay, let me just check the camera. Okay. So let's see what is coming towards you. What is your focus? What is your situation? Oh, why do you have a three of swords? What's coming towards you in love, career, money, in general? Situationship. You have the judgment card in here. You've got the you've got the star card, okay? You could be dealing with an Aquarius, a fellow Sagittarius, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, a Scorpio, a Pisces, an Aries, and you've got the hangman. Okay, guys, let's start your reading. So you're starting the reading with the Knight of Swords. This Knight of Swords is looking into the Tower card. It feels like you're about to hit something big, I would say. It feels like a home run, okay? Um, I feel like this reading, Sagittarius, is very predictive. It means that one of these days, you will... I wouldn't say, because the Tower card is about, you know, a verge. You're a sudden verge, like on the verge of something. But you're still able to keep it in together. You know, like you're about to lose your patient. Or you're about to go into, you're about to confront someone, Sagittarius, you know. It could be leading to the eclipse or post eclipse because the Knight of Swords is looking at the Tower card. And after the Tower card, you've got the Three of Swords. So you're leading, you're about to confront or somebody would, someone would confront you, okay? Um, this is a tidal wave of emotions, okay? Whoever this person is, it's very, very close to you. Because, you know, it could be a lover, it could be a best friend, it could be family. But it's definitely someone very close to you. And the reason why I'm saying that is because you wouldn't feel this three of swords if you weren't affected by what they did or what you did together collaboratively. But... There's definitely some root cause on why you're at a point where you're going to confront them, okay? Or they're going to confront you, okay? This is something that, um, it's a bit of an emotional confrontation, but it's still, I would say it's, it's confronting someone to get to the bottom of the things, you know? It's confronting something that could hurt you, but at least you would lead into a breakthrough, okay? Because three of swords, this is going to hurt, but I need to do it. Yeah, hangman, it's been, it's been stuck. It's been quite into the suspension. It's possible that they're avoiding you or you're avoiding them, but something is going down and you're about to confront, to talk, to talk to them, to have a conversation, and you won't back down, Sagittarius. It means that whether it's a make it or break it, bring it on. 
you would write you would rather take the make it or break it than to spend another cycle wondering what's going on what's going to happen what if what if what if you don't want that you want as soon as possible make it or break it yeah tower card I mean, again look at that you have a lot of re recurring energies in here and the two of wands look at that two of wands you're so ready if this is a competition bring it on if this is someone you they've been doing this to you constantly maybe this is bullying i don't know but it's something that you're not scared to confront it and they're also not scared to confront you so you've got some you've got something to say and they also have something to say so this is a very interesting conversation judgment card the center of the reading is the judgment card you will be surprised that you feel you're more ready they're also ready for you sagittarius don't think that this person is not prepared what to say what to do they're very prepared to face you head on um, with the three of swords yeah eight of wands they're gonna confront you you're gonna confront them it's a lot there is a lot of things to process there is a lot of emotions to process understand there's a lot of back and forth message that i'm picking up sagittarius you know who i'm talking about could be a scorpio aries leo sagittarius energy but it's it's now or never like we talk or we never talk we make it or we break it okay so there's a lot of like opening pandora's box to the very like this person is judgment card okay let's trace it back to the very beginning sagittarius yeah six of cups whoever this person is it could be family it could be an ex it's someone very important to you it's someone that you've spent some sweet adventure they know you well you've got some sweet memories of them you've got some laughters you have a deep connection deep bond with them you understand them they understand you if this is relationship this is like a soulmate who understands you in such a way that they read you um this is a relationship where it's so deep you know i'm also picking up traditional relationship you know family siblings maybe best friend it's so deep deeply connected to your childhood or it's it's very connected to you that it's very whoever this person is in yourself it's very important to trace back the very source of why we went this way it's very important because with the judgment card and the star card something tells me the healing will start the healing of this relationship or connection it will start if you really get into the root cause analysis of you and this person and maybe in the past you were not ready maybe in the past they were not ready but come eclipse you'll be very shocked that this person has built up their emotions their their feelings their thoughts their judgment of you just be ready sagittarius because they also won't back down it sounds like a bit of a clash but it's a clash to be understood it's it's definitely there's a lot of words and intense emotions and energy i'm also picking up that you could be defensive they could be defensive this is like an all-out conversation you will hear some stuff that it will hurt you prepare and they will hear something from you as well that could hurt them but they're prepared so this is this is a conversation that would lead to a lot of heartache to begin with and then it will start to heal you know for some of you guys you will cry they will cry too yeah nine of swords the very the very demon the very demon of the the demon of the connection 
you know, the core problem, you will be able to untangle. Because I feel like in the past, you weren't, or they weren't, you know, I feel like whoever this person is, they weren't very prepared to submit or cooperate and solve the problem, the issues. One of you is close off. You could be close off today talking about this and they're open. And then at some point you move on, you're close off now and they're open. Or you're open, they're close off. So there was a lot of, you know, misalignment. But now it's leading to I'm ready, they're ready. And it has built up into a lot of information, a lot of feelings. Sagittarius, so prepare. It looks like a soulmate for some of you because you've got the judgment card, you've got the star card. It means after this heart to heart conversation, healing will start. The star card, the empress card. Yes, temperance card. They will say. They've never actually wanted to give up. I feel like this person, the reason why they're avoiding, you know, it's a person who I did avoid you because I don't want to actually give up. So I just kept all the feelings, you know, they did like they put you in a compartment. They put all of their feelings and thoughts about you in a compartment for some of you. It's. It could be like a confrontation to someone who's, who cheated on you. Or it could be like a conversation to someone you were getting along with in a romantic situation and they disappear. For some surprising um, comeback, they actually have a reason why they did that. Whoever this person is, they will be, they will be very, very raw of what they will tell you you will get the first hand feelings and information from them no holds bar the thing is the reason why they're so straightforward and blunt and no filter is because they want you to take it all in what they did and how they could take this whole th whether what they did could still allow them to be part of your life Sagittarius so you might get to a point of you know whatever they're gonna tell you you would go through the, you'd, you'd be more angry you know you haven't talked with them and they will tell you something you would be even more angry once you know sometimes bliss what's that innocent is a bliss okay now they don't want to hide details so they will tell you everything you know, whatever, the, whatever took place in the past up to the present, you know, they will tell you everything and it might upset you more. And this is, this is where, can you still accept me and better card? You know, like they will, somehow they're going to test you if you still will be able to up, accept them. Yeah, page of pentacles. They're going to come out raw. They're going to come out the most, whatever they're hiding, they're going to put it all in the table and what they did, like no more hiding, no more secret. That is where they believe they can see whether they can accept you. Like if you can still accept me after I did this, or if you can still accept me or forgive me, there is definitely some sort of I am sorry in here. You know, because the reason why they're saying all of those information, it's a lot, Sag. Whatever they're going, whatever this person is going to tell you, it will blow your mind of what they did in the past or why they did that. The reasoning, you know, for some of you, their reasoning could be spiteful as well. If this is family, could be lover. Their reasoning is spiteful. It's immature. That's why they will tell you everything that this is, this is me. This is what I've done, but I could change from here. Now, you know, can we, can we start all over again? Can we heal? Can I still be part of your life? Sagittarius, you know, star card, the Empress card. They're looking forward to hear you say approve or disapprove. And the thing is, you're quite shocked with the hangman. 
I don't know why I'm picking up that your your heart is beating so fast that somehow in spite of what they're gonna say you still admire them there is still some admiration there's still some there's still some special feelings and admiration that you have for them but the thing is you need some sort of time to absorb they will tell you a lot of information a lot of a lot of information a lot of details and they will ask you to reconsider them yeah ten of pentacles this is it sagittarius this is a situation where if you accept me this is now marriage this is now this is the worst of the fight you could ever be this is the worst of the worst and everything from now up until the future it's actually it's a beginning of a new it's a reconciliation where everything is going to be so easy this is one of the worst you know one of the worst challenge or part of your relationship yeah page of swords the knight of swords i don't think you would say yes right away but i still see you saying yes but not right away you would think about it you would reflect upon it and you would look at them you probably you, pro you will probably say yes but not too soon and i don't think you're delaying it because you're you want to teach them a lesson or you want to be spiteful. You're simply thinking, thinking if they're worth of forgiveness or if they're worth to be part of your life in here. Could be an ex because there's an ex in here, someone you dated. You know, for some of you, it's not as heavy as I describe. It simply is a person who, who would confess everything, of, who would confess their feelings and why they ghosted you and why they probably disappear and they will tell you that okay during that time i was a player i was doing this i was doing that some people you know some people it makes them feel better if they unload all of the good stuff and not good stuff like that's their way of can you accept me they definitely will say sorry and they would follow up if you do not reply they would follow up you're quite shocked i see you very very quiet like you oh really now it's time to think because you know that if you accept them there's no turning back yeah this is it if you accept them there's no turning back i think for some of you you would be able to there is some sort of condition that you will tell this person you've got some yeah you won't reply right away, but you've got your own way of processing it. And you probably will tell them some sort of terms and condition in here, Sagittarius. They're so eager to know if it's a make it or break it. Have they matured? Of course. They're the emperor now. And they're looking forward to spending time or bonding with you with this energy. Yeah, Four of Cups. You're reconsidering it. Take your time. You're reconsidering it. They're offering, they're, they're giving you a peace offering and a lot to take on. So take your time. You, you probably will say yes, but not too soon. There are some things that you would consult with your family, with your friends, with yourself. But if you say yes, this is a 10. It, if this is an ex or a lover, this will go to a marriage. This is if you accept the next cycle the next chapter of you and them it's gonna be easy this is probably the worst so this is your reading sagittarius take it easy thank you so much i'll connect with you soon you have a great day